Hi guys, uh, I hope you are doing fine. I am back with another tutorial. Uh, many people ask me, you know, uh, how to extract uh, text or, or a searchable string from from an image, you know, or a PDF. Okay, so so you know, I was like thinking, like let's share this, you know. So I came up with uh, this very nice OCR, which is Optical Character Recognition, uh, which is a tool. So it is. Uh, Tesseract OCR tool which can be used to you know uh, extract text from uh, an image and convert it into into a uh, into a text file or a PDF file okay so uh, you need to have this in your system there are um, this package you have to install so what you have to do is you have to install this uh, tool called uh, uh, Tesser Tesseract minus OCR. So if you install this, it will install this OCR tool. So I already have this package in my system, so so I don't need to do it now. But you have to install it use, using this. Okay. So once you have installed it, what you you can do it because if you, I can show you, if I do this Tesseract minus H, it will show me. I'm sorry. There is extra s. Okay, it'll show me the the use uses and all that. Okay, so basically you can see it takes uh, the image name that you want to convert, and then it can display the output on the console, which is std out, or you can uh, give a name of the file where it will write to. Okay, uh, okay. So it takes configuration file also. So We'll go one by one. So I'll take a very, uh, I'll take a one sam sample, you know, sample picture. Uh, let's say I have so many pictures in my system. Let's say in my pictures. Okay. So we have some pictures here. Let's say, let's say this one. Okay. So let's try to extract text from this this PNG file. So Tesla can extract text from any kind of uh, uh, image like it could be JPEG or uh, PNG or or uh, GIF or you know TIFF anything. Okay, so let's try this. So it is like this: Tesseract Act, and then the the file name which is there in your system. So this is my this is my uh, this is my um, what do you call uh, image? Okay, this is PNG. Fine. Uh, there is one more. I think there is uh, this Linux. It's actually dot JPG is also there. Okay, it will be there somewhere. This one. Okay. Fine. <coughs> so let's try to extract it. Okay. So once I give this, uh, I have to give a file name where the result will be stored. Okay. So let's give a result. Okay. So uh, and there is an option called uh, minus L. And the language so you can see here right so minus L language okay and if you don't specify that language by default it will act it will take as English okay so if I run this you see it is uh, it is detecting the <coughs> diacritics and it is printing the text so now we have this result if you open this <coughs> so it will always be created as a text file by default Okay, so if you, if you open this <coughs> result.txt, so you will see that it is exactly the same as given in the image, right? Okay, fine. So this quite looks uh, similar. Okay, now uh, let's say I want I, I extracted this into a text file. Let's say I want to uh, extract the image. Uh, extract the text from the image and write into a PDF okay so there is a an option called called config file so you can specify the variables in the config file uh, to 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 generate the output so if you want you know uh, if you open the manual of this you know <coughs> then you will understand how it works so if you go uh, scroll down there is an option called config file which is a plain text which contains a list of variable and their value 
okay so here you can specify the output type okay if you want we can keep it as a PDF okay and there is one more thing so if you want to know which all parameters that can be kept in that config file so what you can do is you can run this print parameters okay so let's say this this act and then this one so it will give you a lot of parameters so you know if I run this will give you a lot of parameters let's say I want let's say I'll just you know put uh, output because I we want to create the output type okay I'm sorry uh, grep sorry grep output so so here you see uh, we can create a text file format we can create PDF file format we can create HTML okay so let's say I want to create a PDF uh, out of the image okay fine so let's take this uh, variable so we'll create a config file config we'll create a config file in the same directory okay and here I'll put this uh, variable name space value okay so there is a format the config whatever values you are putting it should be variable name space value so here you have to give one instead of zero because we want to create a pdf right okay so now <coughs> we will run the the okay well, how about we will run this uh, the same thing with the another text okay let's say how about this one okay we can create anything i mean we'll take some other uh, image this time how about this one okay there are certain things in this okay let it be okay yeah I mean anything yeah let's 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 take uh, okay let's take this PNG file yeah I mean instead of JPEG J JPG we are taking PNG file okay fine <coughs> so how we do how do we do that uh, test sir act test sir act then you have to specify the the file name which is uh, what is it uh, dot okay we are this time we are looking at the png file okay so I have to specify that name okay this is my file now I can specify language okay if I specify language uh, I can give any language but if you don't give it will be the English by default okay then what we are doing is we are giving the config file okay um, yeah so what we'll give uh, okay we'll give an output uh, name as well okay let's say result result 2 okay and then we'll give the config file which is config right yeah okay so and my config contains the, the one only one pa parameter okay so if I run this okay now what should be my output okay let's see result star okay so you see there uh, we have this, this PDF as an output okay so let's see what is there in this PDF okay result 2 okay this is a this is a PDF you can see it is a very nice uh, high quality PDF okay with the same text which was there on the image right okay so this is how we can you know uh, create a text file text data or a PDF data from an image you can extract we can directly you know if you do not specify anything let's say uh, how about if I don't give the config file and I'm just giving here std out okay so you see if I if I am giving std out it is printing the output on directly on the console itself okay which is also one of the usage okay so that's all guys I, I will not go into more complications you can uh, you know if you want you can open the manual of Tesseract and you can uh, you know use it as for your own choice you can you know um, 
you can extract several languages you know it, it, it can be chinese it can be korean or any language okay so if you just all you have to do is specify the language so it supports these many languages you can see here, okay right so that's all guys so it will help you because you know many people ask me how to extract text from an image okay so this there you go and you can uh, try it and thanks for watching please subscribe my channel goodbye